Hello, this is Nathan on Shuffle, and I've got another album review for you. This is kind of an interesting, uh, unique album that I wanted to spotlight. I thought about including it as kind of one of the New Music Shuffles, but I just really loved this album, and it really caught my attention, so much so that I ended up going out and buying the vinyl version of it. So, really have been falling in love with this, and definitely wanted to feature it in an album review. So this may be a little bit of a shorter review, but I thought it deserved its due here. This album that I'm featuring is called Magnified as Giants by Kaligonaut. Uh, excellent modern prog from Norway. Uh, the main man behind this project is Ole Michael Bjorndal. Um, hopefully I said that right. Uh, he is a member of many Norwegian prog bands uh, that are notable, such as Oak, Airbag, and Bjorn Rees. Uh, plays guitar, sings, is kind of a fantastic uh, uh, musician in his own right, and he brings along a lot of great musicians. This is kind of what brought my attention to it, is several members of the band Wobbler are part of this uh, record, which I really love Wobbler, and their recent album especially, Dwellers of the Deep, that came out last year. And so on keyboards, bass, and backing vocals, there's the guys from Wobbler. So this has a very Wobbler-type sound. It has harkens back to their sound with this kind of uh, old-school symphonic prog style that has a lot of, of varied instrumental sections and a lot going on to make some vintage sounds. It's just, it's really cool in that regard that it really harkens back to kind of this old progressive rock spirit that I really enjoy, kind of almost a folky side to it as well. Um, just goes through a lot of different sections and movements. There's only four tracks on the album. I actually have the, the vinyl version here that I want to show. Cool artwork. It, it looks like, you know, a piece of, of modern art um, that I really think is, is cool and complements the album well. Um, inside, of course, we have more of that artwork. And so just wanted to kind of feature that a little bit here. Um, definitely a cool packaging, cool vinyl. Uh, just wanted to showcase all of that because it's just a cool, cool piece uh, of, of the puzzle here. Um, as, as I mentioned, um, the sound quality is, is great. It just it fits perfectly with this style of music and I really enjoy it all the way throughout. And all the musicianship is top notch, stellar. You know, they're all expert players. All these guys from Wobbler especially are just dialed in on their instruments and just sound super fantastic. So I really enjoy the album a whole lot. Um, the four tracks, kind of three epic type tracks and then one shorter track, the title track, Magnified as Giants, which one of my favorites of the album, even though it's the shortest, one of the shortest pieces, it's just, it's a fantastic piece of music with acoustic guitars and, and soft, sweet vocals and harmonies and definitely beautiful passages. So I definitely recommend the title track, but it's surrounded by these kind of bigger epic pieces. It starts out with Emperor, which has some great bass lines, great exciting opening, uh, beautiful lush sound, some violin work. Um, uh, I saw some excellent violin playing is done by Asia Ree. From, she does some work with Mir, which is another big artist that I've enjoyed this their album this year. Uh, definitely recommend that as well. Um, but just excellent violin playing, just those swelling strings, uh, beautiful composition, haunting vocals. There's some backing female vocals in the mix. Um, just it makes the sections between just this ethereal beauty to some darker sinister sections. Uh, all accentuated by great symphonic rock and symphonic prog playing, just expertly done. Hushed is the second track, uh, also kind of a, a good little mini epic. Uh, it features some really cool organ, is kind of one of the features um, by Ivor Cleave is kind of featured on this track, doing all that church organ kind of stuff in the background, but otherwise it's just a folk kind of inspired track with acoustic guitar, Floydian riffs, a uh, beautiful progginess, uh, just great bass work as usual. Uh, just so much going on in the mix. I almost hear a little faint hint of like dancing with the moonlit night in one of the guitar lines in like the middle of the track. Just it's really a cool callback and really adds to the sound and is beautiful. So I really love that. And then it ends of course with the mega epic Lighter Than Air, which takes up about 20 minutes of runtime here. 
um, beautiful guitar work, beautiful keys that come in and add more texture to the music. Um, it starts off kind of soft and slower, but then builds and kind of hits this kind of heavier, proggier section uh, about six minutes in. There's beautiful harmony vocals. There's great instrumental work. Um, the whole band is just playing at the top of their level throughout this track. It just there's so many different sections, some synth solos, some great vocals, grooves, um, Floydian guitar, sweet playing, just everything is working as a whole. It just all is intricate and intertwined and just really works all together in a great and excellent way. So it's just an excellent package that I wanted to highlight and mention. It's just really beautifully put together. A lot of the tracks are just excellent and really highlight some incredible modern prog players just really doing what they do best. I love the symphonic feel of the music. I love the folky vibe to some of the sections and I just love kind of the throwback feel of the music but with kind of a modern production that sounds really fantastic. So highly recommended record. I wanted to feature it. I wanted to make sure people knew about it, so hopefully you'll check this one out. Please tell me in the comments if you have any thoughts about this album. Um, please check it out wherever you can. Um, as I've mentioned in prior shows, I have a Spotify playlist where I throw some of these new tracks onto the mix, so you can go check out my playlist there and play some of these tracks to kind of get a feel for the band and their music. Hopefully you guys will enjoy the music as usual and check this out and thank you again for watching my videos and I'll see you next time in the next video so thanks again for watching